they ain't standing for it no more. The St. Vincent Wharf in Port of Spain, at the time when the city's shoreline was still way in, covering much of what is now South Cape. In Marval, the famous country club was a playground for the elite, a swimming pool in the foreground and the northern range behind. All aboard, train number 42 arrives in San Juan. It was no rapid rail, but it certainly did the trick back then. And if the train didn't pass in your area, the bicycle was the next best option, particularly in Belmont and St. Ives in the 1930s. There's nothing much different about the Cathedral of the Immaculate Conception as it is now, except for the type of cars parked outside. And can you guess what street this is? It's Park Street, way before the Bankers Row came along with large modern buildings in old-time Trinidad and Tobago.